hello everyone this example shows the proton exchange membrane that is pem fuel cell stack model feeding an average value of 100 volt 100 vdc boost uh, dc to dc converter uh, this uh, nominal fuel cell stack voltage is uh, 45 uh, volt dc and the nominal power is 6 kilowatts the converter is loaded by an uh, rl element of 6 kilowatts with a time constant of 1 seconds uh, during the first uh, 10 second uh, simulation the utilization of hydrogen is constant to the nominal value that is 99.556 percentage using a fuel uh, flow rate regulator after 10 seconds the flow rate regulator is uh, bypassed and the rate of uh, fuel is increased to the maximum value of 85 lpm in order to observe the variation in the stack voltage now we will we'll see the simulation then uh, also uh, that will affect the uh, stack efficiency the fuel consumption and also the air consumption after that we can uh, here uh, two scopes are used to, used here for simulation the first scope one uh, it shows the fuel flow rate and hydrogen and oxygen utilization uh, fuel and air consumption efficiency also uh, available in this scope one in this scope scope two fuel cell voltage current dc to dc converter voltage and dc to dc converter current signals are available in this uh, scope two here this is a fuel stack stack model it is available from this uh, library that is implements a generic uh, hydrogen fuel cell model which allows the simulation for the following type of cells okay here not only with uh, pm cell that is a, a proton exchange membrane fuel cells this is also we can uh, use for uh, fuel stack uh, solid oxide fuel cell and also alkanine fuel cell based on that you can uh, choose here these are the parameter free set model you can see in, in this example we are using the free set model is 6 kilowatts 45 volt dc fuel cell stack here itself there is some options are available here which may be used for afc that is alkaline fuel cell and also this so sofc that is uh, solid axle fuel cell based on your requirement you can choose the uh, 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 values that is a preset model you can choose here in this model uh, uh, detailed model or uh, simplified model you can choose here in this example detailed model is uh, chosen here this is a signal variation here uh, we have to analyze the fuel flow rate if you want to analyze these are the uh, signal variations are available here this is a fuel composition accident composition based on that air supply pressure and uh, pressure temperature and also the flow rate also uh, we can uh, analyze there is a fuel cell dynamics value he is taken from this model um, uh, I mean using this library this is a flow rate regulator this flow rate re regulator is one of the uh, subsystem here you can mention the number of cells and also uh, uh, nominal uh, utilization previously we discussed this is a hydrogen utilization we are using 99.56 that is a fuel pressure and h2 composition hydrogen composition we can uh, apply here then this is a subsystem for 100 volt dc boost dc to dc converter is average value here some 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 chopper uh, securities in, uh, included here the with uh, this rl rl uh, rc and uh, rc combination that is a c c bus here this is a flow, flow rate selector here itself you can select the flow rate is a subsystem of uh, flow rate now uh, we can uh, do the simulation Parallel, you can see the here uh, stop time 20 seconds are we are given here this is a flow rate it shows the flow rate and also uh, this utilization of uh, nitrogen and oxygen that is a yellow color uh, it shows the oxygen level and this is a magenta color uh, hydrogen level uh, here itself you can see the uh, graph uh, that is a stack consumption that is a pm cell fuel cell stack model uh, uh, feeding an average value of 100 volt that is over 100 volt uh, dc here then next this is your, uh, stack efficiency also calculated here um, then uh, this scope that is a scope 2 uh, shows the fuel cell voltage and current and also uh, dc to dc converter voltage and dc to dc converter current uh, signals are available in this scope here itself you can um, analyze by using this some uh, additional tools are available here measurement uh, to go to measurement block here itself where uh, you can see the uh, signal statistics also you can view the legends based on that you can analyze the signal statistics uh, here itself uh, voltage 
and the current current statistics you can see the address selection dc bus voltage and dc bus current based on that you can uh, analyze the scopes um, uh, apparently you can see the simulation uh, here uh, here itself you can see uh, during the first is 10 seconds and that is the utilization of hydrogen is constant to the nominal value that is a 99.56 uh, using a, a fuel flow regulator fuel flow uh, rate regulator after 10 seconds the flow rate regulator is uh, bypassed and the rate of fuel is increased to the maximum value of 85 um, yeah, 85 lpm in order to observe the variation in the scope voltage stack voltage uh, that will affect the stack efficiency and also the fuel consumption and air consumption here based on that we can uh, an analyze by using the fuel cell stack also we can vary the uh, by uh, yeah, generic hydrogen fuel cell model with this um, three, three type of model preset model AFC and SOFC and PFMC, uh, PEMFC. Just uh, this is for uh, our understanding purpose. The modeling of uh, PEM fuel cell voltage for any other um, uh, DC to DC uh, converter uh, um, uh, system. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much.